Uh. Ooh, I'm so thirsty. Mwah. Oh. <laughs> mm. uh. mm. So salty. Uh. 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 Oh. I'm sorry. Mm. Sea water isn't for drinking, dear. Why is it so salty? Did someone put salt in it? Mm. I'll tell you why. Let knowledge click. Rain water falls to the ground. As it flows, it wears away rocks and soil. Some chemical reactions also happen when rain touches the rocks, creating minerals. These mineral salts then flow into rivers, and from there, they travel all the way to the sea. The salt stays in the sea because the water doesn't flow away. Then the sea water evaporates up into the sky, but the salt stays behind. Little by little, more and more salt is left, and that's why the sea is salty. Hmm. Wow! <laughs> There's another reason the sea also gets salt from underwater volcanoes deep beneath the ocean. There are thousands of volcanoes working under the ocean. When sea water slips through cracks and meets the hot lava, it picks up more salts and minerals, then flows back into the sea. Wow! That's why oh. sea water is too salty to drink. But it still has many other great uses. Hmm. You can swim and play in the sea. Some things in sea water are even good for your skin. People also make salts from sea water. The same kind of salt your mom uses to cook yummy food for you. I got it! Next time, I'll bring fresh water to drink. That's it for today! Join Wufu as he continues exploring the amazing world in the next episodes! <laughs>